Let's simplify the fraction 5 6. So what we want to know is we want to find another fraction that's equivalent to 5 over 6 has the same value. It's just that we reduced it or put it in simplest terms. When we look at 5 and 6, we're looking for a factor that goes into 5 and 6, a whole number that goes into 5 and 6. We call that our greatest common factor. But the only thing that goes into 5 and 6 is 1. What that means is that 5 6, the fraction, it's already simplified and we don't need to do anything. If you think about the factors of 5 and 6, for 5 you have 1 times 5, 6 you have 1 times 6 and 2 times 3. And you see the greatest common factor is 1. Divide 5 by 1 you get 5, divide 6 by 1 you get 6. That's 5 6. That's what we started with. So in answer to our question, the fraction 5 6, it's already simplified. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.